So there goes Waylon. Uh, when I walked over here, he came running up like he was ready to work. Then when I put the backpack down, he ran away. So he's funny. Usually I try to give him 10, 10 to 12 minutes just to cruise around, even if we've been out already. Like this, is, he was out with the boys earlier. This is the solo time. Um, so when you have a bunch of dogs, You'll find uh, they don't always want to hang out with each other. Now, when he was younger, he was all about hanging out with everybody and uh, group play. Then he started doing, like, in group play, he started uh, letting everybody else play and he'd stay back. I think I started getting a lot more higher energy dogs for a while. And so he started staying back. He wasn't really into, or no, it was a lot more restless. So when there was, when I was getting a, a few chasers and maybe one wrestler here or there, he would hang out. And then, um, and I used him for a lot of reactivity stuff for a while. And I haven't had to deal with that in a while. Um, so maybe that made him kind of not want to deal with it. Maybe when, uh, uh, he was already wanting to be on his own when Chico went after him. Um, but that's just how they are, right? He he uh, matured, matured, and was just like, yeah, I don't care about these dudes. So now he's kind of indifferent. So maybe it was because of workouts. Maybe he wasn't really... He's good because he doesn't react about anything, you know what I mean? So that's why I wanted to use him for reactivity stuff. But I had quite a few for a, in a row, right? And then, I, I don't know the timing. I don't know if that's what made him not want to hang out with dogs anymore. Because he just lays there, <laughs> you know what I mean? And I go and I reward him uh, plenty. Hi, buddy. Where'd you go? Are you ready to work, dude? So, anyways, when you have multiple dogs, just watch their personalities. And they, they might change, but you want to keep fulfilling them, right? So, him, he does really good. Uh, and, and I was doing a lot of group work with him and all the little nosy dogs, right? Everybody wants to get in his face. But like when you're trying to reward him, the others want to get it. And he just started being like, hey, I don't want to do this shit. So... Uh, I didn't give him enough individual time for a while. Um, hi, buddy. Did I? I didn't give you enough individual time, huh? You want some booty scratch? Are you ready to work? Huh? You ready to work? So, anyways, you just watch them. Make sure, uh, keep your, keep your individual relationship, right? So you don't have problems. We just sent a super cool dog uh, that I took in the summer, got adopted, and now they're starting to have problems. So I'm like, well, you need to get to individual work, you know, individual attention with all of them. Don't let that go. And then for what if they're having problems, they need to have somebody local. But these are the things you can do, right? Work on your place commands. Crate them up while while they're eating so you want to work with them individually give them individual time and then also do all the together stuff you ready fool let's go do it let's go do it so uh, things that I've forgotten about is or, or figure eight center rounds and then loop de loops go around one and then around the other uh, I haven't been doing a lot because crew was really good at it and he's kind of whatever with it and then one thing I've noticed too is like if, if he's feeling not feeling like working if I just shut up and don't tell him stuff to do and I just do a bunch of the hand signals really fast he starts getting into it I tried doing it with just with my energy, raising my energy, and he's like, yeah, a little bit. 
But what really gets them is if I do the faster hand motions and make them work a lot more. Sometimes if I'm rewarding every time, he gets kind of boring. So if I have if I have the reward and I make him do like 10, 15 things, he kind of gets more into it. Are you getting bored? You telling me to get up off my butt? Huh? You telling me to get up off my butt, big boy? Huh, big boy? All right, let's go. <laughs> Ready? Ready to step in? the food reward is a release for me it's not right so when he started to get up after I rewarded him I just do nope on the bed and I caught myself starting to give him the hand motion too soon when I went from this bed to this bed instead of letting him do it so the more you let them kind of think about and figure out before you help them uh, the better it is uh, brain brain So there, that time I messed him up because I had the reward, right? Bait, bribe, whatever you want to call it. And he's trying to figure out what he's supposed to do, so he wasn't doing what I was saying. And then I think I tried to do a hand motion, and he went to the next thing that's similar, right? So first on the loopy loop, we used to always do it from heel. But the most important thing is I started moving too soon. And then, so when I mess up too much, I want to get something easy and reward them. So, we, so it's not just a bunch of mess ups in a row, right? Hey, I'm going to call Ready? 
What just happened? I was supposed to explain that I fucked up. I mean, I messed up. Uh, uh, something just happened that I messed up that I was going to make fun of myself for. But I forget. I don't know, whatever. Now he's free. Um, I don't know, it's just fun. Fun, fun silly stuff, right? 